Hello, continuing with uh, probability, examples and probability, uh, let's read the question. 40% of students at Central Hawks Bay College catch a bus to school. Okay, so what does that mean? I want you to think if 40% catch the bus, how many do not catch the bus? Okay, I'll come to that later. 55% of those students uh, who catch the bus are girls. Okay, so here you've got part information. So if 55% of the students who catch the bus are girls, how many are boys? Okay, so that's one part. I wanted to think, uh, pause this video and draw a tree diagram of this situation. And then we'll come back. Once you have drawn it, we'll, draw, we'll answer this question. You can pause this for, say, five minutes and I'll get back to you. So hopefully you have done the tree diagram. The tree diagram should look like this. The first situation that we have got is the students who come to school on bus and the students of students who do not come on bus. So they, they are the two branches. So 40 percent. So say this is the branch of uh, bus taking students, and these are the non-bus students. So we'll write only bus. Okay, so these are the bus going students and these are the not bus going students. So we'll write bus going in short is B and not bus going is NB or let me write B dash. That is a good notation B dash or B prime. Okay, so 40% of the students uh, of students and settle at Central Hawks Bay's College catch a bus. Okay, so 40% catch the bus, so I can write 40% is 40 out of 100, which is as a decimal is 0 0.4. So 40% catch the bus, how many do not catch the bus? Obviously 60%. So 60% 60 is 60 out of 100, which is 0 0.6. Okay, 55% of those students, 55% of those students who catch the bus are girls. So we are talking about this branch. From this branch, you have again two branches. There are girls and boys. So let me use a different color. So you've got girls. This is a G and the other is boys. <coughs> so why did I use why did I use this branch? We need to read the question quite well because it says 55% of those students. Of those students means the bus catching students or the bus, uh, the students who use the bus. So 55% are female. So 55% is, as a decimal is, 0.55. So if 55% are girls of the bus <coughs> taking students, how many are boys? Uh, 100 minus 55 is 45, so which is <coughs> 0 0.45. Now we do not have any information of this group, okay? So we don't will not uh, draw any branches here. So let's read the question now. Find the probability that a student is chosen at random from the school roll is a female student who catches the bus. So there are two situations here. One is it's a female and who catches the bus. Or you can also take like this, a student who catches the bus and is a female. It doesn't matter in any order. So we want to find the probability, probability of is uh, of a student to catch a bus, probability of a student who catches bus, and is a female. That's what we want to find. So and is very important here. So let's read the question. It's very important. If a bus catching student who is a female or a female who is a bus catching student. So a probability of a student who catches bus and is a female is same as finding probability of a uh, catches bus catches bus 
times probability of that student who catches bus to be a female. So what is the probability of a student catching bus? That is 0 0.40. That is 0 0.40 or 0 0.4 times. And what's the probability that is a female? The branch tells me that is 0 0.55. So this is 0 0.55. And you can get your calculators out. The probability will be 0 0.22. Or in other words, there is 22% chance that a randomly selected student from the school role is a female and she catches the bus. Okay, now the next question. <coughs> Let me change color. Of the girls who catches the bus, 35% are senior students. Okay, so again we are talking about the girls who are catching bus so we we can add we're talking about girls who catches bus so you can add a branch here so let me use a different color so you got two from here again you got two branches coming out like this the one uh, possibility is that the student is senior or the student is junior i hope you can see the Let's read the question again. Of the girls that catches the bus. Okay, so this is this branch. This branch is the girl who catches the bus. 35% are females. So 35% is 0 0.35. And so how many are? Uh, how many? 35% are uh, seniors. So 65% are juniors. So the question is, we are talking only of, we are talking only of this part or this much branch. Okay, so you need to, okay, let's read the question again. It is of the girls that catches the bus. Of the girls that catches the bus, what's the probability? 35% are seniors, find the probability that the student who catches the bus is a senior female. So we're interested in only this much part of the uh, probability tree. So we'll write like this. For this, they're asking us, what's the probability? What's the probability? Uh, so here, what's given? It's given, given that the student, given that the student catches the bus. Hmm? This is given, catches the bus. So we are not going into this part. It's given that it is the student who catches the bus. We want to find the probability of a senior female. Senior, the student should be senior and female. That will be probability of being a female and probability, it's probably, this is and, senior and female. So and means you have to multiply and uh, senior. So the probability would be, so let's uh, use a different color. So the probability of a female, of a female of this branch is 0 0.55. So this is 0 0.55. And the probability of being a senior of these females is 0 0.35. Again, you can get your calculators out. So this probability is 0 0.1925. Or in terms of percent, that is 19.25% probability that a student who catches the bus, uh, it, is, uh, it is a senior female student. 